Hey, welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Ball Z Kakarot Part 14. For some reason I have beaten the game. The enemy bases are back. And now we're going to do some sub-missions. So our sub-missions this way, right there. And we're going to be collecting Dragon Balls. And the Dragon Balls are back. And the enemies are going to be a lot higher than these. Yeah, last time we defeated Majin Buu. We defeated Super Boo, and Kid Boo, Pui Pui, and Yakon and Debora. We're gonna do some sub missions. Let's see. Wrong button. Come on. You are not going to be able to fight these annoying enemies by dashing into them. A quick win won't do me any good. And look! Get away from me, you bunch of cretins. I'm going to go Super Saiyan 3 whether you like it or not. Off me. Wow, it's just like Evolution World. The game I remember playing when I was a kid. And the enemies can have the same level as me. They can knock me down easily. How annoying is that? And let's see here. Continually attack the villager. Let's see what else? A father's dignity. And guess who we're going to be running into? It's better to be safe in that cave. So that the enemies do not run into you. I don't understand how annoying enemies are. Yep. I forgot to mention to you. I told you we were going to be seeing Fusion Trunks again. Oh, that's Hercule. We're going to be helping him. Let's see, April. I'm in a robot by now. Maybe Gohan will help me out. You need to have Gohan to help Mr. Satan out. Take the story. Let's count how many we got here. Let's count. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three. 33 sub freaking missions. Oh my god, that's a whole lot. Let's see, how many for Goku? Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. Is 
is that a really? 17. Oh, there's 17 of them I have to see if it rotates. Let's go somewhere else. Planet Namek area has been unlocked. Land of the Kai's area has been unlocked. Off Earth area unlocked. Just why does this off the do off planet area? Okay. This is Land of the Kai's, New Namek, King Kai's planet. Let's go to New Namek. I've been going to New Namek, to Namek since the last time I fought Frieza. Good to know that Guru and, and the Elder Muri are back to life. And even Cargo and Dende. And all the other Namekians that Frieza just killed. Oh, things are quiet today. Elder Mori, how goes it, sir? Oh, let's go collect some orbs. Hello there. Hey, how you been? Goku, I wasn't expecting you. Thanks to your assistance, new Nabok is beginning to flourish. I only wish there was a way we could repay you. Don't worry about it. Oh, I was wondering, is there anywhere I can train around here? Training, you say? Hmm. There is a trial taken by those who wish to use the Dragon Ball. Trial, eh? What kind? The Dragon Balls were originally left in the extra care of the Seven Odins. Hopeful users of the balls were required to prove their worth in a test. The trial. It evaluates basic traits such as wisdom, strength, and so on. Strength? So does that mean I get to fight the toughest guy you fought? As we are all well aware of your power, this test would focus on your sagacity. Sag sag what now? Wisdom, my son. To be recognized from Namek as a hero, one must wield the twin talents of power and sagacity. That's so... You know, I think I might pass on. Today's a great chance to cultivate your mind, kid. I stay to it. What? Naturally, if you pass the trial, you're free to use the Sonic Dragon Ball. Considering our relationship, let's simplify things. You need only take one test. As Grand Elder, my approval alone will suffice. I don't know. Purunga, Part 2. In order to get Purunga to grant your wishes, you'll have to complete the Trial of Wisdom. Well, I could use the Dragon Ball to ask for the best training sesh ever. Yeah, I'll take it. Very good. I've learned new ones you are prepared. As Goku passed Mori's trial. Let's talk to that elder over there. God of dreams, that is what Purunga means in our language. Let's see here. Where? God of dreams, Purunga means. You're Piccolo's friend, yes? His name is Namekian for another world, you know. Another world, dreams. Let's see what else? Alright, time to plant some Ajista. Jisa dreams another world. Of course. Take the trial of wisdom. Yes. Here we go. Very well. First question. What does Poronga mean in our language? God of dreams. Well answered. Poronga is a deity revered, revered by our people since an antiquity. Moving on. What does Piccolo mean in Namekian? Another world. Not Nail, not Demon King. Correct. It is also a phrase used when opening doors. Moving on. What type of plant do we cultivate here? Ajisa, not Suno, not Katas. Most correct. The Ajisa is at the very symbol of Namek. 
Congratulations, you have completed the trial with flying colors. Woohoo! What? That blockhead passed? <laughs> Guess I don't give my noggin enough credit. The Dragon Balls are yours to use however you please. Here goes, I made you a good fight, Parunga. Bring me someone strong. That's a, that is a difficult request. Few in this world can engage you on equal ground. Seriously? However, there are such warriors in the other world. Like who? Frieza has been revived somewhere on Earth. Cell has been revived somewhere on Earth. Deborah has been revived somewhere on Earth. I have brought them back to life, in addition to tapping their latent potential. Awesome! Thanks, Paronga! Farewell. Oh, wow. This is really cool. We're going to be fighting Cell and Frieza and Deborah one last time. I hope we're able to repay your kindness. Boy, did you ever... Well, I'm off to Earth. Place to be. Fights to have. Hmm? Done. Totally done. Hey, you got Purunga Soul Emblem. Let's see. What else? Are there any uh, anything else? Probably go for some mineral. I'm gonna collect some D metals. Why not? Okay, well, it appears that. We're going to head to West City. With the battle against Majin Buu at an end, peace has finally returned to the world. But there are many more frightful foes waiting to strike in all corners of the earth. It's up to you to stop them. Seriously, it's up to me to stop them? That is a whole lot of submissions, guys. I don't know if I can do them all at once, but it's going to be probably too much. Probably too much. Dude, load, please. Dude, load. Oh, golden trout. Turquoise trout. Oh, my God. Okay, th this is where we're going to go see future trunks. Th that was the part I was talking about. But, you have to be Vegeta. Oh! There's future trunks! I was right! There he is! Hey, man! Ta-da! I whipped my own time machine and brought Trunks back from the future. Um, it's, uh, nice to see you again. You brought me here without much discussion. Did you need my help with something? Not really. I just wanted to see you. What? What's the big deal? You may be from the future, but you're still my son. But if you wanted to see me, you could have done so in my timeline. What are you talking about? You like it here, don't you? I went to a lot of trouble to bring you here, so the least you can do is thank your mother. I'm not sure if thank you is what I want to say here. Well, well, you're here now, so take a load off. We got a lot of catching up to do. Okay. Come on, come on, get inside. Oh, we get to see Trunks again. You can now play as future Trunks. Now use the time machine. Time Machine will allow you to travel back in time to a replay main story chapters you've already completed. It's a great way to play stories you missed or get a better rank on others. You will only have control over characters from that point in the story. 
but all their stats and items will remain as they were before you traveled back in time. Upon completing a story in the past, it will be completed upon returning to your original time as well. The following rules apply when traveling through time. Story events and items cannot be taken to your original time. Story event items cannot be taken to, your, to the past, so if story is still available after the game has been completed, can be carried over across past and present. Likewise, items with sub stories still available after the game has been completed can be shared between the present and the past. While you are in the past, you cannot save or auto save. When you wish to return to your original time, either complete the selected story or cancel the story from the story menu. Even when you cancel the story, you will retain all stats you required, such as EXP and super attacks, along with any other soul emblems or items obtained. Okay, I'm going to talk to him. There you are! The time machine is fully operational now. With this, you'll be able to travel back in time and relieve past events. Cool. Hmm, you want to use the time machine? If you're looking for a journey to the past, be my guest. Let's see here. Majin Buu Reborn. Let's see here. Some stories. Nope. Nope. Wow. I got an A rank by beating Yakon because because I didn't raise my stats enough. So now I got a submission to do for now. But, I'm going to put Trunks in my party. So that I can level him up. Like I did last time. Mm -hmm. No, 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 I'll go with Vegeta. Ah, Vegeta's back to his original outfit. Pretty canny. Let's see. <sighs> I'm not going to go back and destroy more bases. Aren't I? This is inexhaustible. Curse you, Saiyan! Curse you, Saiyan! It's Frieza in his first form! What the heck? You! Huh? Who are you? Wait, I know this key. Is that you, Frieza? Hmm. That's right. You never had the privilege of seeing me in this form. I'm sorry, but what is it you wanted from me? The return of the Emperor. Frieza is just full of himself as he was before. Try sparring against him. Oh my god. The return of the Emperor. What do you say we have a little sparring match? Do you mean to tell me that is why you have revived me? Yeah, I guess you could say that. I have countless planets and thousands of servants at my disposal. I'll have you know. I'll have you know. Knowing that, you still intend to use me, the great Emperor Frieza, as your sparring partner? Yeah, yeah, you're, the big, you're a big deal. Got it. Come on, let's do this! I see you haven't changed. You still have a knack for getting on my nerves. I haven't changed either. As I drifted through space half dead and even after I've been consigned to hell, I have never forgotten the humiliation you've cost me. <laughs> Your key is so massive you're shaking the whole planet. I can't wait to fight you. Oh my god. His second form. Let us begin. Yeah, he's, Frieza is at a level 79. He's stronger than last time. It's not going to be easy because we'll kick the living daylights out of this dude. If I could go Super Saiyan 3 and beat the crud out of him. Wow, not even on a level 79. 
my god. I'm running out of health. If it reaches zero, boom, game over. Oh no, I'm back to normal again. Where are you, Frieza? Oh my god, he stopped. Man, this guy is probably strong. He's got a power level over 1 million like last time. Death Blaster? Oh my god, it's like a freaking... It's like a freaking homing attack. Yeah, the Gallic Gun doesn't really help. And yet, being back to normal is not the idea. Buy a drink. Come on, heal already. Yes, thank you. Go back to Super Saiyan 3 so we can kick Frieza's butt. Death Blaster. He's shooting three times in a row. Break. Oh man, that didn't affect Frieza. Pretty good, but not good enough. No wonder why Trunks defeated Frieza easily. Chopped him into pieces and blasted him. Oh my god, Frieza, you jerk. What are you doing? Don't counter me. Oh my god, wow. Last time I fought him, I had an A rank. I should have gone to a level 79. Come on, Super Saiyan 3, dude. Well, you're supposed to scope out the situation, bro. A rank. Level 77, so that's great. Level 79. Level 48. 79 Vegeta. Well, I can suspect I suspected this form alone wouldn't be enough to best you. Consider this a mere warm-up. Come on, Frieza, don't be stingy. I'm not going to get better if you don't go out all on me. You irritating little pest. Uh-oh. It's final form. So you're finally getting serious. This time you will be groveling at my fate. Alright, he's in his final form. So, just like last time. We're gonna, we're gonna, he's at a level 88. Oh my god. Seriously. Please, uh, what is your deal? He's got Death Slicer? Avoid the Death Slicer. What the heck are you doing? Oh, come on, charge up your key. Oh, Death Beam again. Wow. Seriously, what is your deal? Death Pommel? That is really painful. But annoying. He's got two rounds? What are you doing? Okay, Frieza. Goodness, he's like a reptilian, reptilian version of Mega Man. But he's not a Mega Man. Come on, consecutive energy blast, kick the crud out of Frieza. Just getting warmed up, guys. I'm 
I remember back on watching Dragon Ball Z Kai, Frieza ate a crab. In the first episode of Kai, Fre Frieza sounded like a woman. But later, he's now a man. He's now voiced by a man. Ha. S rank for super. This time, super S rank. Oh, Vegeta's at a level 80 and Trunks at a level 50. Darn. I suppose my having just been revived is to blame for this performance. If you're feeling a little rusty, then there's always next time. Next time? Yeah, I want to train with you again. I must say, I never cared for how you speak to me, but very well. After all, a being of my genius would surely succeed you if I were to commit this tr to this training nonsense. Bear in mind, however, that I still intend to kill you. <laughs> That's the spirit. <sighs> wow, still some Z orbs. I rate Frieza. Five stars, how awesome he is. Ah! Freeze this one tough guy. I know. You may come to regret reviving me in the end. Okay, if, okay I'm gonna go. Let's see here. Okay, seriously. I'm gonna check the story. Let's see here. I'm gonna see. Hamu. Else. Okay. You wish for King Cold, right? The Cybermen. Who else? Bobbity's minions and Bobbity. And his henchmen, Pui Pui and Yakon. And Dr. Jiro and Android 19. Who else? Okay. Android 21's one should be in the forest. Right. I might be able to train so that. Yeah, oh, come on. Let's enter in the capsule, Corporation. And I could probably train. My apologies for the wait, but I finally got the time machine up and running. Whenever you're free, come see me by the time machine outside of Capsule Corporation. You can now use the time machine. Oh, cool. I will keep getting stronger, I'm sure of it. Oh, you gotta be trunks. It's really relaxing here. Oh, well, let's talk to her. I'm glad you could make it. Bulma instructed me to show you some rather intriguing data we've come across. It was actually collected from the small spacecraft that was used to escape from Planet Namek. Capsule Corporation obtained the craft and found a peculiar chip in, it, in its onboard computer. We analyzed the chip and found data on the craft's original owners, the Ginyu Force. However, there were also records of a mysterious individual on the chip. According to Bulma's friends, the Ginyu Force had five members. A man, 
a name we have discovered on the ship did not match any of the names of the five members of the force. That name is Bonyu and belongs to a female warrior from an ex extraterrestrial planet. We continue to dig deeper, and just the other day we were able to successfully extract data on her appearance, voice, and combat abilities. It's unclear just how strong she was as a warrior, though. That's why Bulma had, had me reach out to you. She figured you would be interested in helping us find that out. Bonyu's data had already been input into the training room's computer, so you can fight her anytime you like. Please keep in mind that the data is not complete, so there are still some things missing from her simulation. The more you fight her, though, the closer we can get to completing our analysis. We would greatly appreciate your assistance in this matter. And you got that. Ready to begin your training? Let's try special training. Special training has been added to the training room. You can select this option and to fight the mysterious warrior Bonyu. If you defeat her, you'll unlock an additional training exercise that are even harder. Toughen up your characters and see if you can complete them all. Okay, I'll have to toughen up everyone. Mysterious warrior Bonyu. Level 40. I'll have to use trunks. In Android 19, 18 is a support character? I did not know that. We'll use Piccolo. Not Kid, no, not Kid, you Kid Trunks. Future Trunks. But first. Saiyan 3. Right. Okay. Full tilt. Oh, wow. What else? Okay. Nope. No, 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 no. Don't, don't leave. We're increasing my skills right now. You gotta be at a level 100. Wow, we already did Vegeta, did we? No, we didn't.
Perfect Harmony. Super Attack Savant. Alright. Gotta level up Yamcha. Oh, Yamcha's wearing a different outfit. Shots you go to Ninja Bronx, Major 18. Okay. Gonna be loving a lot of kid trunks. You have to be at a level 100 for every characters, and you have to do all training. A lot of villainous orbs you're going to have to have.
Kamehameha. It's Kamehameha, not Kamehameha. Is Goten always this annoying, guys? Seriously. to mention you when you beat this game you're gonna have to get seven dragon balls you have to collect seven dragon balls so that you can wish for king cole back to life bobbity and his minions and his henchmen including spopovich yamu pui pui and yakon and also let's see here who else android 19 and android 20 Dr. Jiro. Cool. Well, that's all. I'm the Cybermen. And Captain Genyu. We're gonna face spawn you. There she is. Shadow level 40. Got an S rank. Looks like you've completed that training exercise. You're welcome to try it again as many times as you like. Yay! If I do a level 75, oh my god, that's going to be annoying. But I'm not going to do that right now. I'm going to go to the community first. Let's see. I'll have to put King Yama onto on in here. And Kami. Right. Okay. I'm gonna put some Namekian, put Nail in the Adventure board. And who else? Elder Guru. No. There. Looking. Let's put Dende in the gods. Community of the gods. That's right. Here. Okay. No. Oh no. Put Kui there. A pool. Why are they arguing? I'll have to put Bun Yu here. Bun Yu, Bun Yu. There you, there we are. Hello there. Power protein, perfect, and rank nine. Um. 
us. Frank of the Kai. Let's see here. Okay, put Frieza here. Okay. Now where would Frieza be? For King Cold, right. You know what? I'd say we switch to Vegeta. No, don't go on the characters. Party. Switch to Vegeta. Can. Presto, we'll be able to talk to Bulma. But first, let's go collect the Dragon Balls. stand up for a bit. I see Krillin, Goten, Trunks, Jiaotzu, Yamcha, Gohan, Tien, Piccolo, and Goku. Over there. Hmm. Let's see here. Dragon Balls. that up. That's one. Okay. We'll turn him in area. We'll turn him in arena. Great sharpener. Is that sharpener? Oh wow, it's him. Hey, bro. Got some treasure. Secret for success. Cooking. And. Three star Dragon Ball, perfect. What's next? No, 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 it's, we should probably go fishing. Might be able to get the turquoise trout. That turquoise trout is probably in here. Let's see, fish. Got a fishing pole, no saiyan tail. That's a red trout, ruby trout. Let's do it one more time.
no, 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 I don't really have time. I don't really have time for fishing. But. I'm going to head to Delange Ponia. And just to collect the Dragon Ball and collect and catch the fish, right? I think the Azuri catfish and the, the turquoise tr trout are probably there. The Desert Gazelle was in the in the area where we fought Majin Buu, Bobadine, Pui Pui, and Yakon and Debora. Well, Debora is in the other area. Where I fought him last time. <sighs> I don't have time to fight that dinosaur, dude. Come on, pick the Dragon Ball up. Okay. Out of my way, you... Get away from me. Hey, seriously, are you trying to concentrate? Oh my god. Just stop me for nothing. Why do you guys why do these guys have to gang up on me? I'm so annoyed. When it comes to ganging up on me. Oh man. Why does the recovery bit have to heal? Doesn't even make any freaking sense. Come on, you irritating scumbag. Yeah. Okay, I'd rather kill this recovery bit first. Because this enemy is starting to get on my freaking nerve. All the nerves of these dudes. Ah. Is that able to become Super Saiyan 2? Come on, dude. Mech Generals. Boom. All right. I don't know. Come on, come on. Fish, please. That's the one. Amazing. I have to catch a golden trout. Yep, Azuri catfish. First time I ever seen it. His things cut of meat on the bones. it now what's next we had to good Idaho lands where we're gonna face to bore one last time
when I had to go die, it's, I mean, it's actually cell. I'm gonna say cell. But first, let's collect the Dragon Ball. Why not? Get out of my way, you annoying enemy punk. Okay, we gotta, we gotta have Goku fight Cell. Come on. Seriously. Get in there, collect some of the rare items. Divine Awakening Water. And so that's how it's done. Those guys are at a level 65. I am not exactly sure if I'm going to go defeat all the villainous foes. At this current level. I really do need to be at a level 100 in order to beat Mira Otoga. Oh, Mira, he's the big guy. But let's switch to Goku first, for now. And let's head to the community board. And come on, let's see here. Okay. Well, let's give some training some training based items yep power protein to use ultimate awakening water diverter. Yay. So first we're gonna go face cell. This enemy stops keep interfering. These are friggin', they need to friggin' stop standing in my friggin' way. Booyah. Three more to go. But first of all, I'm going to check the Dragon Walls. Got a little seven, the wish list. I want to meet King Cold and his men. Bobbity and his minions again. Fight the androids, 19 and 20 again. Let's get rare items. Okay. Alright, let's just, let's just go. Carry on. I'm gonna face Cell. Let's go, Ku. Hey, it's been a while. What am I doing here? Was my core not completely destroyed? 
Perfecting perfection. This has been brought back to life with the Dragon Ball. See if you'll become your training partner. Okay. We're gonna face Cell. I brought you back to life. I brought you back with the Dragon Balls. By the way, where's this school you were talking about? Hmm. I'm not in the habit of divulging my secrets to my enemies. I heard you told Vegeta and everyone else. You think I you think what I told them was the truth? Oh I get it. Anyway, let's go a few rounds. I could use the training. And why would I do something like that? Because you want to. Is that so? If you got sand cells in you, right? Then you can't resist the urge to fight. Just like me. Hmm, you're not exactly wrong. I suppose I could make you rethink of your decisions to revive me. Oh, he's powering up. Ooh, a Super Saiyan 3. He's at a level 80. And I can't believe he's higher than me. A level higher than me. On. Hey, don't use your Kamehameha. Where are you, Cell? There you are. Don't think you can hold out on me, man. Charge up. I think this is one of my favorite moves of all. Okay, juice up your key. And presto. Where is he? How is he this fast? Oh great, he just countered me. See combo. It. Enough. So transform to Super Saiyan three, so that you can beat Cell faster, right? And out of key. Let's see here. Well, no, no, no. Punch me, man. Kaboom. You're finished, Cell. Super S rank. Level up. Goku reached level 80. Vegeta reached level 82. Trunks reach level 52. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You are Goku after all. You're far stronger than you were during the Cell games. But if you're capable of such strength, then I, being comp comp comprised of your cells, should be as well. Yeah, probably. Hmm. You will be bowing before me after our next fight. Cool, can't wait. Cell is super awesome. And we got a soul emblem. Ta da! Shell sure is loads of fun. He sure is, Goku. I have to agree with you. I will continue to get stronger. Okay, let's put him on the community.
Chow 2 self destruct and Vegeta 2 and the Cybermen? Oh my god. We're Captain Ginyu here. Right? Okay. And this, I'll have to put the Cell Juniors in. Yay. Okay. Now this time, but first of all, I'm gonna switch to, I'm gonna switch to Vegeta. No choice. And Kohan's at a level 90, good thing. Story. Bulma. The captain's come back. Southeast Island area. We'll have to go there. Southeast area. Has anybody done all the submissions in the game? I did once, and I'm gonna do it again. I remember this game. I remember doing it last year. It's been a while. Check our map. We're gonna go play as Gohan for, for now. No, no, no. Not like we have a choice. Got to do two of them. Ah, help! Oh no, not the kooky cook cook villager. Please save me, these weirdos came out of nowhere. T these three tenemen. The it's continually attacked villager. The kooky cook from the village is being attacked yet again. Save her by defeating her attackers. Oh, she's the same girl as I saw last time. You're up against me now, do your worst. We're gonna fight three Kuwar or Tenemen. These guys are a level all at a level seven to eight. What are you doing? Okay, I have to use power unleashed first. Stop. Let me go power unleashed this time. Come on. Gotcha. Ding. Super S rank. Awesome. All right. You're safe now. Thank you so much. I thought I was a goner. Wait, is that you, Gohan? Um, yes, it's me. Long time no see. Oh my heavens! Look at how much you've grown, and you're so handsome too. <laughs> so you're still you're all getting attacked, huh? It, it's like there's no end to it. What is it about me carrying the food that makes me a target? All I'm done, all I'm doing is carrying primo ingredients to make some extra delicious food. 
I think that's why you're getting attacked. They're probably after the high quality ingredients you're carrying. Well, they're not getting their grubby hands on them. <laughs> well, I'd better go. Good luck with your cooking. Wait, don't just go yet. I still need to thank you for saving my life. Please take this. Oh, a premium seafood course recipe. What? Are you sure? Of course. Please take it. Take it. You can use it to whip up something tasty. Thanks. I'm not going to be the one doing the cooking, though. See you again, Gohan. Again, huh? I'm pretty sure I will. I think it's probably the last time we'll see of the Cookie Cook Village, right? A sub-story unlocked. Wonder who it is. But first, we're gonna go. We're gonna go help Mr. Satan. Shut up, King Kai. Nobody cares. We're busy. No lagging. There's a home run. We have to talk to Mr. Satan. Go on, my boy. Am I glad to see you? There's trouble afoot. Trouble? Big trouble. World is a dinosaur was sighted on the outskirts of Satan City. The thing's too quick for the police, and the military can't get loose this clown to town. This close to town. Long story short, the city asked me to get things under control. Well, you better get moving then. I'd like to, really. But I made the mistake of having extra spicy chili for breakfast and... Whoa, the pain! I can barely move! Are you okay? No, I'm not! Go in my place, Gohan. Do it for the city. A father's dignity. Mr. Satan wants the dinosaur approaching the city to be taken care of. He'll do it for himself, but his stomach's bothering him. Go on, can do it though. This is what happens when you eat spicy in the morning. You get acid reflux. I'll take care of that dinosaur, sir. Spoken like my number one discipline. Disciple. Spoken like my number one disciple. Go get him. Wait, I'm his disciple now? The location of the dinosaur has been marked on your map. Okay, let's go on. Get rid of the dinosaur. There's one dinosaur that we have to destroy. It's no good. I think I'm in a slump. Everything I make is other garbage. I can't even look at them anymore. My finest work are buried at the bottom of the heap. What a waste. Won't someone please remove this trash before it offends me any further? Sorry, sir. I don't have I don't have time for this. Please get away from me. Okay, fine. I'll battle you guys. One slippery punk. What's with these recovery drones healing their ally? I'm about to go Super Saiyan. Why are these tenements so obnoxious? No, don't use the Masenko. Come on, stop recovering. Come back here, I'm not done with you guys. Phew. 
See? Friggin' told ya. Now then, let's go beat the crap out of that dinosaur. That gigantosaurus. Remember in the anime Dragon Ball Z, Goten becomes a, a preteen and Trunks becomes a teenager too. And they fight in the tournament. I remember the voice actor for Goten, a teenager, an adult. He was voiced by Robert McCollum, who also did Shinobu Sensui. That's Gohan, report back to Mr. Saint. Yeah, as I was saying, Robert McCollum did the voice of Rainer, Reiner from Attack on Titan. And who else? He also did Harutagarn and Barry Khan from Dragon Ball Super. He was jealous of Gohan becoming a great Saiyan man. Yeah, let's go talk to Mr. Satan. Here we go. I took care of the dinosaur. God, also out there, kid. He's laughing. Why is Mr. Satan laughing like a nut job? He goes, ha, 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 ha. Soul Emblem. Nice. I see your stomach's better. Yep, right as rain. Oh, come on, Dad. You're not fooling anyone. You just pushed your own troubles on Gohan again, didn't you? Videl, what are you talking about? I haven't seen you train in weeks, Dad. I'm, be I'm betting you were just scared of fighting. No, 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 that's not true. In the old days, you were really strong and cool, and had a backbone to match. Ouch. Mr. Satan, we got a real nasty bank robber in the progress. These perps have a state-of-the-art caliber that repel our bullets. We need your help. Want me to take care of this? Don't be daft, boy. I can handle this on my own. What a man... What's a man if he can't impress his own daughter? Dad... Enjoy your final moments of freedom, evildoer. Mr. Satan's about to get serious. Go get him, Dad. Your dad certainly has his moments. <laughs> yeah, every once in a while. Another sub-story? Wow. Okay, let's go keep collecting the Dragon Balls first. Then again, okay. As I, oh yeah, as I was saying, then again, I might be able to. I have to talk to Master Roshi about how the training goes. Very nice to know. Gohan is about to be on the level 100, right? Oh, I'm going to talk to Krillin. But first of all, no. This time, first of all, we're going to get the Dragon Ball. Where are the Dragon Balls? Where the heck are they? Oh my god. Right there. No. No, no, no. Pick that up. Baba's crystal ball. Okay, we're gonna talk to Krillin. I really don't know who to turn to. I bet Goku finds some weird ways to help me out. He's good at this sort of thing. Secret for success, adults. Okay, check my map one more time. Zoom in. 
Come on, man. Let's check on the map. Is there a Dragon Ball there? It is at the Kame house, but where could it possibly be? Right there! It's right there! Forgot about them. Now we got two submissions? Honestly, why does it have to be so many submissions, guys? Oh wow, it's Mercenary Tao. I remember him. He was the guy who was trying to search for Goku as his target for getting in the way of the Red Ribbon Army's plan. So Bora tried to stop Tao. And with, this is when Tao throws Bora high. He sends him flying. And he goes, here, have your spear back. And he stabs Bora in the chest. He shish kebobbed Bora, and then Goku got really mad. He tried to beat him up, but he dodges. And he's too fast. And he launched a Kamehameha on Tao, but didn't damage him. But it, all it did was ruin his outfit. And then he did a dote on Rui on him. Okay, two more. Mm, let's see. Let's add one more. Seriously. No, no, no. Two more. We're going to head to Luka Village and face Tabora. We're going to face Tabora and, and fight him one more time. Tabora was in heaven. And he read a letter from Chi Chi. Bora was revealed to be a good guy. I'm probably going to switch to Go Goku. But first of all, I'm going to I'm going to talk to Deborah. Let's switch to Goku. We're going to switch to Goku. Okay. Whoa, is that you, Deborah? Oh, Goku, my most profound apologies for the trouble I caused you and your friends. I want to go a few rounds with you, so what do you say? Come on! You want to fight me? Absolutely not. I cannot bear to harm another living thing. Did something happen to you? I could have sworn you were a bad guy the last time we met. Indeed I was, and I was wrong then. I was merely fulfilling my role as king of the demon realm. When King Yama saw how elated I was at the prospect of going to hell, he sent me to heaven. What? You went to heaven? Yes, the time I spent there allowed me to see the error of my ways and cleanse the heart of evil. And that is why I cannot fight you. Man, this sucks. I was really hoping to fight you. I'm sorry to disappoint you, but I cannot fight if I have no reason to do so. King of the demon realm? The boar is back and he's a changed man. A uh, demon. See if he'll forgo his pacifist ways and fight you. I know. What if I pay you to fight me? I'm sorry, but I'm afraid that's not good enough reason. I know this guy, Mr. Satan. I know this guy named Mr. Satan. He got, he's got loads of money. I could go get him to pay you. You could use that money to do some real good in the world. So if I fight you, I could receive enough money to help others? Yep, that's right. I see. Very well, then. I accept your offer. Now you're talking. All right. Okay, we're gonna fight Deborah. He's at level 81. He's revealed to be a good guy. Mm. 
come on. Come on, stun him, bro. Ow, flame blaster. That really hurt. Yay, break. Oh darn, back to normal now. All right. Watch out, flame blaster, coming your way, Goku. Ow, direct hit. Seriously, stop using that sword, man. Okay. On. Yay! Oh, I got an A rank. What I get? What's wrong? Is this all the power you can muster? You still have to see what I'm capable of. Jeez, you really are something else. Are you not aware of who I am? Huh? You really are a good guy. You're a really good guy now, right? <gasps> oh my, it appears I've gotten a little carried away. You know, I'm actually re relieved. You still are just as strong as before. Let me know if you want to fight again. I will. And yes, about the money you promised me. There, as there is no need for me to receive it myself, I would like to have it donated to a charitable organization. You got it. I'll ask Mr. Saker to take care of that the next time I see him. Oh, what a cool guy Tabor is. I rate him one of my favorite characters. Yay. <laughs> I'm really glad Tabor is still a super strong guy. Yeah, he's super strong guy, all right, bro. <laughs> Banana failed. Really, King Kai? Let's check. Let's see here. Stranger danger. We're going to talk to... Why, oh, he, he looks like... The tour guide. This isn't good. I need help. If only there were a superhero like that great salmon I've been hearing rumors about. He wouldn't be in Gohan, would he? But this time we're going to switch to Gohan. This isn't good. I need help. If only there were a superhero like the great Saiyan I've been hearing rumors about. You there! You haven't seen a little girl around here, have you? Um, no, I don't think I have. Oh, what am I going to do? Is something wrong? I can't find my daughter Ramu. Oh, that's awful. There must have been something, some horrible rumors in the town recently. People are saying strange green monsters have shown up around the village and in large numbers. Green monsters and lots of them. He's definitely not talking about Piccolo then. And they're stealing crops from people as well. Oh no, I bet one of those green creatures kidnapped by Ramu. A strange girl named Ramu has gone missing and strange green people are supposedly to blame. Find Ramu and discover what happened. The Cybermen he was talking about. Oh, where could she be? Okay, I can help you look for your daughter. Really? Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, I'll keep looking here. Would you mind checking southwest of here? Southwest? Sure, I'll head that way and look for her. Whew. Let's go, Han. Search for Ramu. Oh, 
Oh, leave me alone. No! I'll just fight those guys. There's no point. Power unleashed, bro. Level up. How nice. Those aren't green. Is that a Namekian? Owie! Mysterious figure. Alright, that should do it. Just take it easy and you should be back to normal in no time. Thank you. You really were strong. You were really strong. I'm impressed. <laughs> Namekians? I thought Pickle and Dandy were the only ones left on Earth. Huh? Huh? Wait. Your? Go on. Go on. Is that you? Wait, Neck? Yep, it's me. <laughs> it's been a long time. What are you doing here on Earth? You didn't head back with the others to New Namek? Oh, yeah, that. I asked the others if I could stay here on Earth instead. Huh? Really? I mean, I need more than water to survive now, right? I figured there would be more, you know, more for me to eat on a planet like this. Oh, yeah, right. Makes sense. Um, who are you, mister? Oh, that's right. You're Ramu, aren't you? Yeah, why would you ask? I knew it. Um, Nick, you didn't kidnap this girl, right? Kidnap? Why would you ask that? No, this person helped me when I lost my way and got hurt. Yeah, I don't kidnap people. <laughs> right, of course. I've actually gone I'm really out of my way to make sure I avoid contact with Earthlings. Why's that? Look at me. Don't you think most Earthlings would be scared of someone with green skin and antenna? Actually, Pickle has shown his face in public pretty often, so maybe not. When I saw this little girl was hurt, I couldn't just leave her, though. Uh, it was you who taught me that helping people in trouble is the right thing to do. Right, yeah. You remember that, huh? Yeah. Well, we better get little Rama back to her dad. He's worried sick about her. Bye. Have a safe trip back. Wait! I don't go back if Neck isn't with me. What? But I... No, I'm not going back without Neck. Looks like she's taking a real liking to you. Guess you're going to have to tag along. Kokon takes the two back to Ramu's father. I see. Wow. Yeah, so you see, this person isn't a monster. Hmm? Well, I appreciate you taking care of my daughter, but I still don't know if I trust you. Daddy, you don't trust Nick? Uh, it's not that I don't trust him, sweetie. It's just that there are supposedly a lot of strange, other strange green people around, so... Mm, I do sense some key. I better check around the village. Wait. What is it, Gohan? Wait. Th wait here. There's something I need to check out. Better look around. There might be something nearby. Let's go on and investigate where the strange key is coming from. Those Cybermen. Those are the Cybermen that the, that, that the guy was talking about. Yak ya! Yeah. You! Yak ya! Yeah. So these are the strange green people he was talking about. There's a lot of them. You guys are the ones causing all the trouble in the village, aren't you? I'm not going to let you frame Neck as criminal. I'm putting an end to this right now. Yeah, yeah. Kind of reminded me of of Dead Rising when 2 when Chuck Green was framed by TK and Sullivan for causing the zombie outbreak. I mean, who would ever frame people for their crimes? 
Level 77, the Cybermen are at a level 77. Bam. Ding. Phew, that should be all of them. Time to head back to the village. Huh? Uh-oh, another one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ah, stop it. I won't let you hurt the people here. Neck. Yeah, yeah. Go on. Get away from them. They're all at a level 77. Wow. Ah, who's blasting me? Gotcha. Punk. You're all, you're all safe now. Thank you, Gohan. I'm so sorry. Huh? Even though I doubted you, you still try to protect us. How can we ever repay you? Oh, I was only doing the right thing. People on this planet help each other when they're in trouble. Right, Gohan? <laughs> That's right. Thank you. Not only are you brave, you are kind-hearted to boot. No, 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 I'm not that impressive. You know, if you've got nowhere to go, you're more than welcome to stay here with us, Neck. What do you say? What? You risked your life to protect us. That makes you one of us now. I'm one of you, but I look nothing like you. I'm just going to cause trouble for everyone. We can't let you struggle on your own. Let us help. It'll be the right thing to do after all. We want you to do what we can to help you. Yeah, Nick, you should live with us. <laughs> um, I was actually, actually, I was getting kind of lonely, so I guess I could stay with you. Thank you. <laughs> Yay, Nick's gonna live with us. <laughs> Isn't that great, Ramu? Good for you, Nick. We owe you your thanks as well. Oh, I didn't really do much. I'm just glad to see everyone's happy and safe. I owe you too, Gohan. Oh, no, you don't. You handle yourself just fine. Just do me a favor and have a great time here. Okay, you're a great friend, Gohan. <laughs> no, no, no. Forgot the Dragon Ball. It's in that cave somewhere. Oh my god. Oh wow. Okay, let's just put Krillin in the party. No, 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 no. Let's not put Krillin this time. Okay, we just put Krillin here. Check the trunks. Yeah. <sighs> okay. No, I forgot something. Oh, 
Off the radar. Stay away from me. Seriously, I'm trying to collect that orb. I don't have time to deal with enemies like you. Wait. It's on top of the cave, right? No. Well, I'm not on top of it, but before entering in the cave. in Goku's house. Alright, gotta stand up. Meteorite. We're going to destroy that enemy base. Seriously, oh, let's zoom. There's that Dragon Ball right there. Okay, next, I'm going to go see Bulma, right? Right now, before we do that, the frequently attacked villager. This is where we're going to go see that kooky kook one last time. But please save me, these weirdos came out of nowhere. Seriously? The kooky kook from your village is being attacked? Save her for the umpteenth time. Preferentially attacked villager. So this is where we're going to save her one last time. You're up against me now. Do your worst. Level 78. We're all at a level 78. Wow. 
solar flare would really help. Come on, rapid fire key wave ought to do it. Bam. Come on. Why does it have to be a lot of submissions? You're safe now. Thank you. So this is pretty uh, much normal for you now, isn't it? Well, I knew it was you, Gohan. You saved my life again. It's uh, good to see you again. <laughs> you know what? I think I'm finally going to have to throw in the towel. Throw in the towel? You're always coming to my rescue whenever I'm attacked, right? And I give you ingredients and recipes. That actually spreads the word about my dishes. Don't get me wrong, I love to cook, but I know it's important to pass on what I know. I guess you could say me getting attacked and you saving me has allowed me to do that. At least that's how I'm going to think about it. Wow, you're really committed to cooking. It might be actually great. I might actually be grateful for uh, now for getting attacked as much. <laughs> well, you know the drill. Here are your ingredients and recipes. Heavenly ramen course recipe. Thank you. Have fun with those, okay? The lady's the real character, that's for sure. Looks like some high grade stuff. I know. There's aloe, owl crop. You might want to head to Nam's village and get that deer. That desert deer. Oh great, Bobby's henchmen are there. Quite frankly, I don't really have time to mess with those guys. Okay. Where's the desert gazelle? Where could these gazelles be? Oh my god, we're ready to fight Bobbity Special Forces.
kidding around. Leave me alone. Desert gazelles are actually in. What am I saying? In a different area, but first I need to go check on the story. Southeast Islands area. We head to Laco Village. No gazelles in the in the desert. Where we fight Bobbity. Talk to Bulma as Vegeta. But right now, we're going to collect some orbs. Peace has made them soft. Okay. I'm gonna train and try something new. Final flash. Okay. Cool. First, I'm going to customize Super Attacks. Shoes, Final Flash, and upgrade it. Windbreaker Gallic Gun. Super Final Flash. Wow. But let's go talk to Bulma. A 
I wasn't expecting you to see you here, woman. I can go whenever I want, thank you very much. I go on vacations too, you know. Anyway, what do you want? A suitable training father. You on this blasted rock can last more than seconds against me. Ah, oh, you Saiyans. Oh yeah, I heard from Krillin that you guys fought some special force on something on Namek. I bet their leader's pretty tough. Why not fight him? Can you? Hmm. I highly doubt he'd be much of a challenge for me now. And I couldn't fight him even if I wanted to. He was turned into a frog and died when Namek blew up. But wasn't all life on Namek transformed into Earth? Aside from Goku and Frieza, I mean. That would mean that Ginyu's guy should be somewhere on this planet. I recall spotting a few odd frogs since then. Maybe one of them is Ginyu. What? Yeah, near the house. It wasn't just these people from Namek. The animals were transported too, you know. Type of transformation that should be shared immediately. Hey, don't blame me. It's not like I ever saw Ginyu's new frog body or whatever. Hmm. The conniving captain couldn't have gone far on those stumpy legs. This could work. I can use the Dragon Balls to return him to his previous body and power him up. <laughs> I finally have someone worthy enough to push me even further. The captain would be an ideal training partner for Vegeta, but not as a frog. Get him back in his previous body. Mm, I might as well. Time to find those Dragon Balls. Using the Dragon Balls, return to C C Captain Ginyu. Okay, using the Dragon Balls? Return Captain Ginyu to his previous body. Dragon Balls. First wish. Captain Ginyu in his previous body. King Cold and his men. Mm, Bobbity and his minions again. No. Summon Sharon. West area. Continent center area. Bobbity and his minions in the far southern islands area and other areas. As Vegeta, go find Captain Ginyu in the west area. In the west area. Now I'm able to learn Final Flash. Get into this. The this Phantom Gate. You know, Vegeta's laugh is old, it never gets old. Every time he picks up rare items, he laughs. I'm back to normal? But how? But first, let's go to the community board right now. Let's see, Deborah. For training. Cool. Give him Divine Awakening Water. Yay. <laughs> All right. 
fight. I'm gonna be able to fight Captain Genyu one last time. Oh, I'm gonna collect some orbs for right now. Let me get sturdy bolt key. Sure, what the heck? Yay, two sturdy bolts D. Oh. Where was I? Oh yeah. All right. Here we go. Hey, Vegeta. No condescending go equips, can you? That's un quite unlike you. I've been keeping tabs on you and your band of do-gooders since arriving on this planet. I'll obey as a frog. I'm well aware you've gotten stronger. I would be a fool to challenge you now. How flattering. I would thank you for restoring my body if it weren't for the creeping suspicion that you intend to shatter every bone in it. Heh, <laughs> such keen powers of perception. But as I doubt I have any choice in the matter, do your worst. Very well, let's see what you can do. We're in a battle, Captain Genyu. Oh my god. He's at a level 75. Let's try Final Flash. No. Final Flash! Come on. Going down, buddy. Yay. N not bad. I see the mantle of Captain isn't simply for show. Why, thank you. Balma, done already? I came out here hoping to see you in action. Silence! I am training! Your body belongs to me now, Vegeta. Does it? Fool, I anticipated that very thought. Ugh. Aha! My prediction was on the mark. Now die. Wait! I know. I've been living off a diet of flies. C can you blame me for wanting a little upwards elevation? Hmm. Shameless to the end. Instead of devoting your time to hijacking the bodies of others, try treating on your own for once. Fight me again when you're less pathetic. Yeah, you're the one who wished me back, snite son of a... But you make a valid point. I'm the captain of space's finest fighting force. Only I can protect the honor of my position. Very well, promising words. By all means, have at it. I'll be waiting right here. Yay. That's cool. <laughs> At first, community. Oh, wow.
Yay! Cool. Adults, right. Better by giving them him an ultimate awakening water. Okay. Okay, okay. Now I'm able to be to train. That annoying house. We're going to talk to the researcher. Let's do a special training. Let's, let's, let's play as Vegeta. Gohan. And let's put Trunks here. We gotta get Trunks stronger. We'll fight Banyu. But first, let's just switch to Gohan for the time being, at least. She's at a level. She's at level seventy-five. You know. She calls for murder. Tea time. She uses a block. Protect herself. Burr's at a level 72. He's got a blast ball that could be very annoying. That counts as an enemy. shower Ta -da.
Okay, I'm not going to do advanced right now. I'll end stream. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Gable Gaming 5000K. I will see you in the next video. And take care. Bye-bye.